Okay, let's see how this set up. It looks good. Hey, y'all. Oh, my God, y'all. I'm coming on here looking a mess. A hot behind mess. This is a week before my vacation. It's like I just had an epiphany. Like, oh, my God, I leave in a week. I have to start packing, and I have to film a video on pack with me. And, um... James, one of our um, fashion dolls, because the men can be fashion dolls too. They sell boy dolls, so the men are fashion dolls too. I don't know if y'all like to be called that, but y'all are all my fashion dolls. So James, he love, um, he said he love all my videos, but he really liked my packing videos because he wished to travel someday. So he wanted a, um start to finish packing because usually I pack and I don't, I usually don't close the suitcase or I usually stop it because it's so long. So I'm going to attempt to pack everything and get the suitcase closed and then go to my shoes close that carry on and then go to my personal item and close that carry on of course i'm going to be in and out the suitcase after this packing video because i still have stuff to put in here that's not here yet i still have some toiletries that i need and um i'm taking liquor with me i always take liquor on my trips i got to put my liquor in this suitcase so i will have to maneuver some stuff around once i get my liquor because i don't have it now and um when i tell y'all it took me two hours or more just to get all this together. Just to get all this together without even packing. That was two hours. Which made me exhausted. I'm exhausted and I didn't even want to do the video. I said I could do the video tomorrow, but where am I going to sleep at? I can't, I need my bed. So I would have to just do the video now. I was like, I have to do the video. I just have to. Because if I was to put this stuff up, the video wouldn't have got gotten done. So let's just get into this video. I'm trying not to make it as long. I'm going to try to make this video as quick as possible. Yeah. I'm sorry, y'all. I'm like Dave. And I'm just thinking that. I'm really going here. I'm just looking a mess. I think I always look a mess when I um do my packing videos. I know it's that. I always look a mess when I do my packing videos. I mean, it's exhausting. Uh, let me drink my tea. I don't want my tea to get cold. Mmm. So good, but it's so exhausting. All right, so enough chit chat. Let me. When I look up like this, if y'all ever see me like ga gazing, gazing, I'm trying to think of what I'm gonna say or remember what I have to say, if that makes sense. Because I know a lot of times on my videos, I just stare, I start staring at the wall or staring at the face. I'm thinking of what I want to say, so I won't forget anything that I have to say, you know. So, um, let's see what we have. With. Okay, I'm going to try to make this video no longer than 30 minutes. Let's see if we can do this. So, I have everything that I'm taking here, and I have stuff here also. All my shoes is going to go on my carry-on, and probably my um, beach towel and my um, washcloths and stuff will go in there also. So... Um, I'm not basically showing y'all really what I'm wearing, but y'all gonna see me as I'm packing it. So this is a cover up, as y'all know. Mostly everything was featured in a haul or try on. Y'all know I do the roller method. So this is the swimwear bag. This will be all my swimwear. And let me make sure that these are the big bags because I had them separated. These are the small ones. Let's see. Yeah, this is the big one. So I need the big one for the swimwear. Is it one bigger than that? I need the biggest one for the phone. Okay. Are these the same size? Yeah, they're the same size. Okay, I might need two bags for the phone. So this is a six day trip. Six days, five nights, however you say it. Um, What is this? Something that broke off or something. I don't know. Okay, so next, I'm trying to keep everything together that goes with that. That's the cover up for this. I'm taking like two cover ups for this because I'm not sure how I want to do it. Okay, so next. These packing cubes and um, um, what you call them? I always get the name wrong. Um, forgot. Vacuum 
They're not called vacuum bags. Oh, uh, compression bags. Compression bags. Because you don't vacuum it. It's a compression bag. So, so that's two swimsuits so far, y'all. Keep up. Keep count. Because y'all know we can lose count when it comes to my swimsuits. That's two swimsuits. Alright. This. Go with this. Oh, my God. Y'all know this set was so cute. Too cute, too. So y'all, as y'all know, I'm packing for Barbados. That's my birthday vacation trip. I know Kimberly Scott was just saying, um, I haven't really talked about my birthday trip. But that's because it's the videos that, well y'all have seen it now, but videos that y'all haven't seen yet. Because I wanted it to be a surprise. I really didn't want to talk about it until it was like, um, coming up. So that's three. Because now I'm losing count. Is that three swimsuits, swim, y'all? That was three swimsuits. Just make four. Um, yeah. I just wanted to be a surprise. Okay. That's four. One, two, three, four. Okay, this is five. Now you would think we would stop here because all I need is five, right? Because it's only it's six night, but the six make the day that we're leaving. So you would think I only need five, but you know I don't only need five. I'm always in the water, so this is six. <laughs> Y'all, this is six. Sometimes I um change my swimsuit twice in a day, so this is six. And this is all stuff that y'all seen in haul and try on. So y'all already know what it is. I don't have to show it. See, that's where I take up time showing y'all all it. So this is the seventh and last bathing suit. So, y'all seen this stuff already. So, that's where I go wrong with my um, packing videos. I start showing y'all stuff that y'all already seen that's irrelevant. Irrelevant. So, if y'all haven't seen it, y'all can go watch it um, after this video. Let's tie this. Ooh. Oh, won't you take up my time? Am I in frame? Alright, here we go. Then we're gonna. I might not, yeah. Mm, I don't want this to get wrinkled. Let's see how can we do this. I'm gonna just slide this in, fold it like that, and slide it in. Because I do not want that to get wrinkled. I mean, because this looks like, it seemed like the type that would just wrinkle so easily. This is another thing that's gonna be considered. A cover up and probably act as an outfit also. I'm gonna roll it. I wasn't gonna roll it, but I'm gonna roll it. So we managed to fit all the swimsuits in one bag. Good for us. Now I got extra pair um shorts. That red um cover up is gonna act as a cover up for two bathing suits. Yeah, for two bathing suits. Here we go. Here's the part where you gotta pay attention. You gotta see this many a times when you're doing this, but you want all the air out. And I got these bags off the Amazon. They've been used over and over again, so they they're definitely reusable. You wanna put all your weight on it. And I like to close it and then get a leave a little open right here at the corner. And then I just press on it as hard as I can so that air can go out. This is where what takes up most of my suitcase and makes my suitcase overweight is my swimwear. So I try to have it as compact as possible. And let's get the jewelry because you want to always 
fill up your corners. I fill up my corners of my suitcase with my bras, jewelry. I already had that pack, because y'all, same jewelry. Nothing new. The only thing is new is what y'all saw. The one I went on my birthday. So I'm going to put this under there as well to fill up the corners. And I need to get my bras too to fill up the corners as well before I start taking any more. This is the one that I'm taking. Ooh, this one is going to take up a lot of space. I never take this on vacation, which I need to start because that's the best strapless bra, but I know it takes up a lot of space. So, that's one, two, that's three bras. Okay. And then I need to get my perfume. Oh, mm -hmm. More air can get out of this. Uh-uh, we gotta take some more air out of this. This is not close enough. Well, you know what? It's a hole in this bag, so. Something ripped it on one of these trips that I've been on. Something ripped it. But it's still okay. It's still fine. Alright, and remember I got two sides. I got this side and that side to put stuff in. So, this is another bra. That makes four bras. I probably don't need all these bras, but I like to have um, a lot of bras and underwear when I'm on vacation. Alright, so, what else I need to put in here? I think that's it for the bras. Okay, so now we're going to do the outfits. So I need another big bag, which will be this one. And I need to get my perfume because of the simple fact. That's going to go in my bras too. That's how I keep it from breaking. It's going to go in between my bras. So my famous perfume that I always take on vacation is either the Justin Bieber, um, what is it called? Exclusive and then Amaze Express. Is it exclusive or limited edition? Limited edition and Amaze. Amaze from Express. So I, what I do is I put it in. I'm in a traveling group and somebody just asked, how do y'all, um, when y'all go on vacation, <laughs> what fragrances do y'all take? And I was like, they go right in between. I told them what fragrance and I was like, they go right in between my bras. And I never had a problem with it breaking, thank God. Banana, they can like, I don't wanna sit. Okay. It's like it's popping up. It's like it's making a liar out of me. Alright. Well, let's put this one inside this ball. Alright. And then everything else sits on top of it. I wonder why it's on there. Alright, so I'm killing time. I'm losing time on me. Oh, this was another um cover up that's gonna go and the swimwear bag so we'll just lay that on top since we didn't put it in the swimwear bag so this is my coming back home outfit Ooh, okay Got it. i made sure i cut all those um annoying forever 21 tags off because you know those tags are annoying i made sure i cut all of them off and make sure i pack me a lint roller because i got a lot of not a lot, but a couple black items that I don't want to be all linty. Um, What else is going in here? That's one outfit. Keep count. That's my coming back home outfit. That's one. This makes two. If I can find the top, they go to it. Okay. Tea break. Because what's going to happen is I'm going to forget about it. And it's going to get cold. And I'm not going to feel like heating it back up. All right, so second outfit. Now for the clothes, I might need two bags on my. Um, the rest, all right. Third outfit, cause it's mostly dresses. I don't know if I should put those dresses in the bags or just lay it across. I know y'all. Alright. So two, that's two, three outfits. Third outfit, three outfit, third outfit. Okay. 
It's been on two trips so far and I haven't worn it. So let's see if it get worn on this trip. I try to bring stuff that's not too dressy because usually I have all dress stuff and then we go somewhere that really don't require a dress like that. And I'm always like that. It's always been like that though. I'm always overdressed. So I'm getting in the habit of bringing stuff. But then it don't get worn. So that's one, two, three. That's three outfits, y'all, right? One, two, yes. Yeah. So this makes the fourth. Fourth outfit. So y'all know I used to do like, um, if I'm staying six days or five days, I'll do a day, a night, and swimwear. Um... For each day. Day, night, swimwear. So that's three outfits. Two outfits a piece and swimwear. So now I'm not more so doing it like that. Because a lot of stuff end up not getting worn. Suitcase be overweight. So I'm doing it different. But let's count the outfits. That's one. That's one, two. I lost count. I always do that, y'all. One, two. One, two. Who can't count? One. Two, three, four, four. How can I count? Okay, because I'm trying to see. Alright, that goes with that and that goes with that. Alright, that's four outfits. Alright, now the dresses, I think they can just lay across the suitcase once everything is in. All these dresses. I think they all can just, well this one can get folded because the way it's made. But everything else, I mean rolled. The way it's made, but everything else can lay across. So that's five. Five outfits. So we're going to seal her up. Ooh, did I bust this one open? Alright, let's make sure I got all the one. Yeah, that's five. But you know what I can do? I can put my pajamas in this bag also because it's still space. So I got one, two. I'm going to take in three pajamas. This will be two nights for this one. Two nights for this. That's four. And then... I'm just going to need one for the other one. One night for this one. That's how we're going to do it. Because I usually pack too many pajamas. And there's no need. <laughs> no need to pack all those pajamas. Okay. But y'all know I'll buy a lot of pajamas. For someone that sleeps in the nude, I'll buy a lot of PJs because I know I vacation a lot. So you have to have PJs when you vacation. You can't sleep in the nude. I mean, unless you with your significant other. But that's not the case in this case. Alright, so. <laughs> I'm rambling. So. That's five outfits in here and three PJs. Took this on vacation and I reward. So, it shows I'll be taking too many PJs with me. I just like the fact when I get out the shower, I want a fresh pair of PJs. Like, even though they're still clean, but they were sweating. I mean, sometimes you sweat in your sleep. But when I'm home, <laughs> I don't have that problem. But when I do uh, wear PJs, I don't get a... a, a um, brand new set every night so I need to think like that when I'm on vacation. I think when we go on vacation we just think so luxurious I guess. Okay. So we and I thought I needed this. I don't think I'm going to need this. So that's good. I don't have to take this. So I'm going to just put that on the floor for now. So that we don't need. And all my pocketbooks too is going to go in my Shoe bag. So what I'm going to do is, all my shoes and the um, carry-on is on the floor. Once I close this and stuff, I'm going to stop the video and then come back with the shoe portion. Because I don't think I ever, yeah, I've done it, but I haven't. I'm like fully showed them. I'm struggling with closing this. Like making it thick. And lately my, um, my luggage scale, I changed the batteries, but it's still like off. When I go to the airport, it be, it's, it's off. I don't know what's going on. Okay, so I just pray that this stuff is not overweight, but I always have another bag. So I'm just going to fold that like that. And this one I'm going to fold as well. 
Just fold it once like that. And that's all it needs. This one probably can even go on the sides like this because I still have space on the sides. This one. I'm, oh yeah, I have to pack my steamer. I have to get my steamer because this stuff is going to require steam. Definitely got to pack my steamer. So fold it once. Lay it right there. This one. What is that? This get folded. This not. This don't get folded. This just lay across. This is a real dress a dress. There, I don't want it to lose it. So I think some of this stuff. One of the couple of these bags won't have. One of these bags won't have to go over there. I feel. So we to empty this part. That part is empty. Oh, that's another dress. Okay, so. What I'm gonna do is slide one of these bags out, which is gonna be this bag here is gonna get slid out and put over here to balance it. And what I think I'm gonna do is I think I'm gonna lay this stuff over here. This one is getting laid over here. So how many outfits we said? It was five outfits in the bag. That's six. This seven. That's eight. This is nine. So I think we got ten outfits. Because here go the grand finale. This one is definitely going to have to go right here. This is what's going to take up everything. Even though it's fluffy, it's still soft that it can just go in here. But I don't want it to lose its tool fill. But it's definitely going to have to be covered. So everything, that's all going to go over there. And I still have room for my liquor. And with my liquor, I'm going to put it in my flask. My plastic flask um, pouches. So it won't take up a lot of space with the bottles. So here, this part is done. As far as underwear, I think I'm gonna put my underwear over there. It's right over here. I think I'm gonna put it over there. Okay. Yep. And I have headbands, headbands and stuff is gonna go in my carry-on as well. All right, so. Oh, what I'm doing? I'm not done. We go another dress. This one can get folded like so. We'll go right there. And this vest. I don't know if the all 10 outfits gonna get worn. But this is another thing that's like dramatic that you don't want to lose its fluff. I took this on vacation to um Turks and Caicos. That didn't get worn, so it's gonna get worn this time, hopefully. Oh, this rough. See, I'm doing the wrong already. This rough will go here, like this. I don't want it to lose it still. Or do it go like this? I don't know. So, this goes like this. Stretch twisted, that's fine. Um, I want to get all my underwear over here. So, I want my underwear in my um packing cubes it's a pa packing pouch rather <sighs> sorry but my allergies acting up yes i roll my underwear too it saves space it really saves space so that's two so far i always go overboard when bringing panties three because majority of the time we're in swim swimwear so when you got swimwear on, you don't need to have underwear on. That's three. And this is the Spanx. So that counts as underwear two, four. Uh, all the underwear, come on, come on. Uh, four. Uh, five. Where we at? Mm, sorry, y'all. All right. Six, I think. Okay. Seven. And then when I pick underwear, I think of what items I'm going to wear, like dresses and what will require um, shapewear or space or, you know, I look into all of that. All right, that's all the underwear. Ooh, I think I might need more underwear. I think I didn't take enough this time. I might 
might need more underwear. Let me look in here. I'm sorry, y'all, but I thought I packed enough because it was one that I had put back or I thought that I packed it. Is this it? We're going to pack one more, um, like, spank. And then we're going to pack these just to be on the safe side. Because definitely need underwear going back home, too. See, this is the one I thought I put in here, but I didn't. Okay. And then we need one. You can never have enough um, spiker shorts or spanks. All right. So that's enough. It's probably more than enough. All right. So we're going to put this over here. As far as the lick, I think I'm going to put the lick on this side as well. I think I want the lid go over there too. Okay, so that's the other way. So that's everything that's going in here. Everything else is going in the uh, carry-on. So I don't want to get my tool port in the zipper. I got to remember that tool is in here because it can easily snag or rip. Okay. Um, I am going to lay this across here. Yeah, lay this beach bag across here, and everything else is going in the carry-on. Okay, so this goes over here like this, like so. That's everything, y'all. So we're going to close her up. I don't see any smart home devices. Oh my God, Alexa, nobody, Alexa, stop. Nobody's talking to you. She keep doing it. Alexa, stop. No one was talking to you, girl. I didn't, I didn't even say your name. She got to stop. And then when I am talking to her, she ignore me sometimes. Okay, so that was it for that, y'all. Suitcase is done. Done. Done, done, done. Here's my... My cousin got me this. Ooh. This says more amazing. Um, luggage tag. And as y'all know, I got... This, this is more amazing, too. Um, what's next? Okay, so now... And this is what I meant by my carry-on. Once I when I bought this, I put, I wrote, realized that I had something to match it. So this goes in. I didn't have to um stop the camera. All right, so this is the carry-on. So this is how we gonna do this, y'all. Exactly how we gonna do this. Look at this. What's this? A pill? Damn pill. And that's a um headache pill. Yep. I make sure I have all my pills and everything. Okay, I am gonna stop because I gotta get all the shoes up. Okay, y'all, I'm back. I am tired. My back hurt. Uh, I had to go grab my shoes bag, um, my toiletries, and my. I think my toiletries are gonna go in my carry on. My makeup is definitely going in my um, personal item, which is a backpack, which is right here. Okay, so. Shoes. These are the sparkly gold glitter ones. This is the bag they came in. I forgot to show you all the bag they came in and everything. So this can just lay flat in there like that. And as for my all my shoes, they're gonna go in here. This is a packing cube, y'all. Okay. Here's one. So I'm taking three heels, three pair of heels. Lately I haven't been taking heels on vacation, but it's my birthday, so I'm taking heels. So here's one. Two, there's two, there's three pair of heels right here. Whew. And then I think one more shoe or something can go in here. These probably can go in here too. Just fill it up. And then in the other bag. Well, let me I know it's wrong. I don't have it zipped a little. I gotta have it zipped a little so it can stay. Alright. So here we go. And now get the just all right. Put that there. You want a foundation to make it as a square how it is. This can go in there. No, I think this is gonna go on that other one. And this is gonna go on that other one. Oh, I don't want them to get dirty. They brand new. All right, here we go. I'm gonna put these in here. All these shoes have been worn before. Or the shoes can just go by itself. It's just like right there. These all can go in here. I think if they all fit. What y'all think? Oh, these these have been worn before too, but they're so 
sparkly. I don't want them to get messed up. These are the shoes that I'm talking about that I'm going to change into for the club with that um, red poofy dress. And I'll wear the gold glitter heels inside the restaurant, whatever restaurant that is. Um, all right, I'm going to just put these two in here. I'm going to put these in that other shoe. Um, Heckin' cute. <laughs> See that shoe? If it seems like I'm rushing, it is because I am. Because I know this video is probably longer than usual. Because I usually don't do all these steps. I just give you all the gist of it. But Oh, socks. These are socks. These can go in here. That I need. They were supposed to go in here, but they can go in here. Okay. I need socks coming back home. Headbands. Throwing stuff. Headbands. Towels and all this stuff. I think this can go in my suitcase. I think I'm going to put that back in my suitcase. Um, pocketbooks. This is one. Going right in there. Another headband. I'm not taking that many headbands this time. More towels and stuff. Um, look at all those um, packing cubes I didn't need. Usually I've been using mostly all of them. So, I'm taking all these. <laughs> They come in handy. I got jewelry in here. This is bracelets. Taking this one. Finally wearing this one. It goes cute with that key maybe even suit. Ooh. I knew I had more underwear. Look, more panties. Panties can get thrown in here. I knew I had more. So then I really have too many panties. But I like that you can never have too many panties. Alright, more bags. Sunglasses. They'll go on top. I have more packing cubes. That's it, y'all. Because my personal item um, is already packed. It's just the stuff that's coming, like, not coming. I got to go get it. Um, I need more Excedrin and, I mean, not Excedrin. Aquasalsa, Benadryl, I need stuff like that. That's going in there. But that's basically done. And um, my snacks. So I can fit some snacks in here, too. That's what's going in here. But that's done. But I'm not going to put this up yet because I'm not finished with it. But... That's basically how I pack my stuff. But I'm not done. This is going in here too. This is a um a beach um beach um rug, if you will. You can wear it as a um, cover up. It serves as different um purposes. This is my beach towel that I'm taking. This is a watermelon one. I think out of the um taking mostly all of them because you know I have different ones. This is my towel that I'm drying off with. Whenever I take the watermelon beach towel, I always take the watermelon towel that I'm going to use to dry off with. Um, what else? This is my wash rag. Face and body. These I think I'm just going to put in this backpack because I'm taking this too. This um, headbands or whatever. And I'm going to add probably more scrunchies and stuff in here for my hair because I want to have braids. And that's it. As y'all can see, my beard is clear. It feels so much better. Can't forget this. This is my lint roller. This can go in here as well. So I still have a little space. Say if my suitcase is overweight, I still have a little space to put stuff in here. And I'm going to have space in my personal item as well. So lately, I've just been taking a personal item and checking. This time, since it's my birthday, I have more stuff. I'm taking a check-in and personalize and it's a longer trip, too. So, this is how it looks. So, I hope this was good to everybody, especially you, James. I hope you like, and this is how this one will go. It will be on here like this. This is actually, can act as a check-in, too. This is a really good bag. It goes like this as well. I can roll it as well. It stands up and rolls. So, what I do is zip this up because I probably won't need this part the rolling part zip that up okay if this one here I honestly never um taken this bag with a check-in this used to act as an, as my check-in this is my um luggage that I took for um Jamaica I only took this and I had took a personal item bag and that was it and I was fine Throughout the years, I don't know why I start only packing, but here we go.
this is how it looks and I'm done so that is my packing video basically everything all I'm missing is I make my makeup and all that but I'm not packing that yet because I might need it before I leave so my makeup is going to my personal item bag anyway and that's it all this stuff that I didn't need so I think I did pretty good without needing any of that and that's only because I use my pocketbooks and stuff as places to put my jewelry instead of adding another bag or something to put in so utilize your pocketbooks and all that and I still have pouches on each side of here I got a pouch that I can put stuff in here I got um like if I want my underwear could have went in here too so I still have space but you always you don't want to over pack it you want space just in case you have to take some stuff out and you want to have space to bring back souvenirs if you want souvenirs if you want to bring back souvenirs but um that's basically it so I hope y'all enjoyed this video this was my packing from beginning to end this is the suitcase and I'm trying to figure out how I'm going to have this I think I'm going to have to do it like this because I don't know how I'm going to do it to have, have it stay I think I'm going to do it like this it's going to be like a tight squeeze but the good thing about this suitcase is it just rolls as long as I hold this and go I can just pull it this way like that so I'm good that's good so I'm packed and look it's staying up it's staying up here so without me holding it so that's good at least I know it'll stay up here so if y'all like this video please like it subscribe to my channel if you haven't missed already hit the notification bell so you'll know when all my videos are coming out share this video so someone else can see how I pack my stuff and how to pack and save space and you know um front I'm um, front <laughs> beginning to end uh, I'm tired y'all leave me a comment let me know how y'all like this video until next time love you guys ciao bye my fashion house bye y'all and I do have a list of everything that I still need to get oh this is dirty and that's because this part I usually roll it I never carry it but this time it's getting carried um it drags on the ground so oh y'all know but I know y'all probably looking like damn it's dirty I haven't used this in five years <laughs> So, um, what else can I say? Um, yeah, I do have a list of everything I still need. I got my notes ready. Hopefully tomorrow I can get all that done or I still have time to get all that stuff. That's just minor stuff I have to get and just throw it in my personal item bag. And I just have to get my liquor and stuff and put it inside my flask, um, plastic. If y'all want to see me, how I, um, put my, um, liquor in my flask, I'll probably just do it. Because by the time you see y'all, y'all see this video, it will... Y'all can't even answer because I would have already done it. I'm just going to do it. I'm going to show y'all how I put my liquor in my um, flask um, containers. But, um, yeah, until next time, love you guys. Ciao. Bye, my fashion house. Bye.